going to bring you back. We've got one harvest remaining here. And what I was going to do is just have a look at this standard yield. Let's see what happens. So there's the berry, but there's no seed. So I want to know what ha what happened to the seed. Why are these not producing seeds? Do they need to be kept in a colder condition to be raise the farming rate? Um, a bit difficult if I can't find another seed to uh, to do that with. But I'm not sure how we're gonna. Don't know without somebody posting it online somewhere. Still the amalgam coming in, excellent. Um, okay. Next thing we need to do and uh, is I'm going to build down here, and we're going to build. going to build along here. Great excitement in my house, we're hearing the ice cream van. But we don't need to dig this out and just leave the, the, the sort of the gas, the gas building up a pressure in here. So um, I'm going to put a mechanised airlock in here for the minute. In fact, we'll make it a double one as well. that and that and then we're going to dig out come on guys dig out two here and then we're going to build dig through that see it's, yeah, it's coming out at 75 degrees so it's going to be a little bit uncomfortable for the for the guys Okay, I'll make that. I don't want to make it an all. I do want to make it a. Um, where is it? Organic slime and algae. of abyss light as well, which I probably will need for, uh, um, yeah, that insulating stuff. They say, right, let's have a quick look. Uh, what are we looking for? Right, there's a slow learner there. Uh, he's okay, he's okay, he's got better constructing and digging dark legs. I like that one, so let's have him. Diver's lungs, I like. Now, can I want to tempt him down here? How do you tempt him down? I mean, to be honest, it's not letting any air uh, polluted oxygen into here. He's producing a lot of slime, which, uh, yeah, get some. Uh, I put bio distillers in there. I want to be able to pump that somewhere. In fact, yeah, I want to. Got this bio dis this this here. I forgot about wiring this one up, but we can. That's not a problem. Put my liquid pipe in, and the outlet from here. And let's put into there as well. In fact, we're going to make take some mesh tiles in copper, build along there. Actually we're just going to dig that out as well. Put two or three in there then. I wonder if I can mop that. Just mop that little area there, guys. Well you can't get to it, can you? Alright. Okay, cancel the mop. What are we doing up here? Alright, yeah, lots of polluted oxygen around. 
Uh, I haven't completed that yet. But I do want them a little impatient to do this, so... Let's get them digging that out and then I'll bring it And up. I'm back. And we've had a bit of a, uh, a, bit of a mishap here. Um, <laughs> I don't know how all this natural gas got up into here. Uh, the, the, the old... The, this... The old um, natural gas geezer here did its thing. Um, but then, unfortunately, I don't think they built these two quick enough. I should have made these a higher priority. But how did it get through here? Is it just so volatile? I don't know. Uh, there is, well, I think, you know, I can make a couple of gas plants and we'll pump it out and we'll chuck it. It sits around this area here. So what we, I think what we will do is we, I want to, uh, yeah, I want to build, dig this bit out a bit and then we'll pump it back okay, in. Okay, we're back. And just as they're going to build this, I thought, well, why pump it straight into here? Why not pump it straight into the generator and see how that works? So we're just going to bang bang a generator into the main line like that and I'm assuming we need some sort of pumpy thing and I'm gonna put actually we're gonna put put some mesh tile in there get rid of that as well and I need uh, need a need a probably a gas pump and that will need to go to a gas filter. It's getting a bit tight around here. Uh, so it'll be out. Oh, we go in there. Oh, doesn't work. All right, come on, uproot. Well, once I've got rid of this, I can get. Once I've, I've done what I need to do, figure out how to keep the gas within the. There we go. Uh, and then filter out the gas into there and that to be honest probably can come up and we'll just dump that up there with a vent and some wiring and make all that a big priority seven as well Yes, right, quick, quick, ladder, ladder, ladder. Always doing things like that. Come on, Come on guys. Okay, uh, make it a higher priority. Because I'm going to end up losing these two. And then I'd better start thinking about some um, first aid as well. So let's bung in, particularly a rejuvenator. A rejuvenator over here for now. So I'm not particularly planning this particularly well, but there we go. So are you gonna build this? Go on, guys. Building lacks resources, what's that? Oh, right, okay. Uh, yeah, no more wheat grain, but that's not a problem. We've got loads at the moment. These are coming up to fruition. And I'm going to make a more, few more of these as well. With a bit of luck. I um, just want to say, when they produce, have we got anything? Yeah, there's one there. I suppose... Uh, do they... Mm. Right, let's... Uh, I'm going to reject all those for a minute. Just have a quick check of my jobs as well. Just check I have got... Oh, 
have got an artist. Well, I've got two artists there. I've got one really decent cook. I've got loads of decent power, etc. Uh, hmm. Well, that's a bit of a pointless thing. Are they all they all want to be massaged, surely. But there we go. Uh, come on, guys. Come on. Get all this. Lots of building for you to do. All this natural gas. I need to. Um, I think once I've cleared all this out, I need to seal this off. So we'll build. What we need to do is definitely build a pump in there. And I probably need to make it. Because actually, if that's all sat at. I don't know, 46, 47, well, that's not too bad. Uh, but I need to watch the temperatures, really. But at the moment, it looks to be alright. But we will put a gas pump in there. And make a ladder up to it. And I want to... Oh dear, this natural gas is going everywhere. Oh, look at it all flowing up here, that's not good. Um, yeah, it seems to sit on top of the... the CO2. But there's masses of it. So I do need to pump it down here, keep these closed, but... Let's uh, need to put some power across to here. Oh, across there. Plug that in to there. Can worry about switches and things later. Um, need some piping. So, gas pipe here, here, up here, across here. Well, and we'll feed that into the same one. Then I'm gonna right, so looking at this, I think I was. Look at the gas. I can't remember where they. Oh yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, fine. So come out of there. That needs to be go to what is this natural gas? Natural gas. So that'll be that. That's an outlet, which means well, this is overpressurized. Oh wow. Um, well, that's fine because it's going to suck up all this natural gas in a minute. So I'll bring it, bring it down. With a bit of luck, he says. No gas output. Why? Why is nothing happening? Come on! Right, let's have a look at the gas line. Okay, so we've got. Oh, I see. Ah, oh, right. Um. I haven't got an output from there to there. Okay, uh, I need to deconstruct gas pipe between there and there. And bring... Where's my gas pipe? Bring that across here, up there, into there, into there, back up into there, and that straight across there. And make all that. An eight. see how this works. And if this works, I think that might be it for this episode. Come on. And there's a big fat nothing. Why is there a big fat nothing? Ah, oh, is there an outlet on this? Uh, there is. Well, what's it? Natural gas generator. What's it, what's it produce? Okay, here we go. Uh, da, 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 da. 
unbreathable condensation point. Blah blah. blah. Properties natural gas unbreathable. Right, let's go. Need to probably empower. But look at this. It. Oh no! Come back in here. It's requirements natural gas. Yes, gas input, gas output. It outputs polluted water and carbon dioxide. Um, this could be a bit of a problem. This, this could end up chucking out more stuff than I really want to chuck out. But okay, let's let's see. Doesn't seem to be any water output for that. So don't quite see what the polluted water bit is. And then there's there's a gas output. To be honest, let's just shove that. Let's just shove that up there for the minute. And pull a valve in there. And obviously make all that a uh, priority eight. Geezer here. It, oh, I don't know. 149 kil. Ah, oh, that's why. This is all two kilograms. This is under such pressure. Right, so I need to make this a decent priority as well. So let's get that all made up. And then I'll keep this closed in. That's why, because the pressure inside of here was huge compared to anywhere else, even though I've got a double airlock on it. Uh, meanwhile, this guy here might cook. He hasn't got anything to cook, so let's get him... Well, to be honest, might as well be doing some power. In fact, he might as well be doing everything, really. Get him doing everything else as well. Let's see, at some point I need him on the micro mushura. I expect if I start running out of food. But oh, look at all this gas flooding into here. Brilliant, it's lovely, but that's perhaps, I don't know quite the other way of tackling that. I suppose the only way of doing it is putting a water trap in, which I can do. That's not a problem. I've done that before. Still annoyed about those bristle blossoms. But, yes. Uh, the sooner these guys start bubbling, I think, the better as well. But let's get rid of this. Try and get rid of the natural gas problem. Come on. Why? Are you not work you're not working. Why are you not working? It says here about gas being over pressure, but so why is this pump not working? Why is that not working? Everything seems to be wired up. I'm just not getting in. Right, can I open up a big vacuum? point anywhere, dump some of this pressure. In a word, no, I can't. Uh, uh. I mean, obviously, because this is all over-pressurised. duplicate for the minute. I really don't know, so I'm gonna, yeah, I'm going to have a look around, see if I can dump this pressure and get these things working and I'll bring you back. Yeah, I've spotted my deliberate mistake here, so uh, yeah, just quickly, because things are really going downhill rather rapidly. Uh, we're going to take out that, we're going to take out that. In fact, we are going to bring that one 
and yeah, gonna bring that one down and put him in there. We're gonna bring that one down and put him in there. And we're gonna take that's an in, that's an in, that's what I want. So uh, we need to as well up here where I did relieve a little bit of pressure. I have left a little bit of stuff in on the put. Mechanised here, not kidding. Uh, and that answers the question of where natural gas sits in amongst chlorine. So it'll sit on top of chlorine, no problem at all. So yeah, managed to relieve a little bit of pressure. These gas vents are not under pressure. The only thing that's stopping them is because I've round <laughs> this the wrong way around. Oh dear. Uh, so we'll make all that an eight. Come on, make all that an eight. And wait to see what happens. Come on, guys. Quick, quick. And still nothing happens. Why? A little bit of water here, fresh water. That's the ugly cryer in action then. I really just caught, caught him just there. There he is. There you go. He's stressed out. Uh, all my guys are stressed out. I haven't got enough thingies. It's all going pear shaped, all very quickly. Now, why won't you? Okay. Let's have a look. Pump. Pump to in. In to out. That disappears up there. Natural gas comes into here. Into here. No problem at all. That one will come out uh, into there, into there, and then comes out of there and then gets just a bit up in here. That should work. So have a quick look at the electrics then, see if everything's powered. That's powered, that's powered, that's powered. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Uh, they haven't got around to making that yet, so that's fine. So why is this no longer... Ma why is this not making any power? Why is this not pumping? I don't understand. I want to make, make that an eight. I want to get rid of that fairly quick. I don't mind a little bit of chlorine in around here. Particularly those mobs can get hold of it, but otherwise... Yeah, there's a bit of, is there some chlorine down here? Yeah, there is. But I don't understand why this pump's not working. Just says gas pump not pumping. Right, back to the gas. So out of here and in. Gas flow. So this is. Have they swapped the colours around? That's why. The is that. So was this right the first time round? They have a... Have I got this wrong? I've, I'm looking at that. I'm sure green used to be in, and now it's out. The easiest thing to do with that is get hold of a gas filter. Deconstruct the gas filter. Come back to... Yeah. Well, I'm going to crack the piping and then I'll be right. back. Sorted it. Now I'm going to have to go back through my videos because I'm fairly certain the green used to be the input and the white used to be the output. But I might be just having a bit of a grey moment here. But yeah, now if I go into here, I can see that all this natural gas, ah, actually all this carbon dioxide is all coming out here. So yeah, so carbon dioxide there, so I need to change that output and put it down here to wherever this gas, this thing's going to be down here. Or I need to pump that somewhere where it's just going to be completely out of the way. At the moment, that's fine. We'll just you know, keep it up there, it'll be fine. Just out of the way. And uh, now this is producing uh, 800 watts. It's also producing a little bit of heat, but not too much at the moment. But it's just, it is the amount of carbon dioxide it's going to produce. So, there's not an awful lot going on there. But 
what we will do is I will move we'll move the CO2 pump down or the, the outlet down to here somewhere so it's pumping up underneath this scrubber and then we'll use the scrubber want to get the scrubber going so next thing to do then is prioritize that So I could pump it into a hydrogen bubbler and it's going to bubble, is that going to, dew point, what's the dew point of oxygen, 183, so it's going to, it's going to uh, liquefy at about the same point. So I could pump all this into a liquefier as well and liquefy it and keep it somewhere cold. here as cold and let it you know, do itself. But at the moment that's sort of using up my uh, reject, reject. Okay. So that's that little crisis. Well, I don't know if it's averted. I've got to get rid of all this natural gas first, but at least it's producing electricity, which will mean not going to run around in these the hamster wheels so much. Now this could be that actually there's enough produ natural gas produced by here that it keeps these batteries topped up no problem at all. But uh, certainly uh, at the moment by the looks of things this thing's running full welly apart from producing... Let's have a quick look at these stats again. Let's say, hang on, back in here. Uh, power, power. And back into natural gas. Okay, so in natural gas it uses 60 and it's producing 80 grams per second carbon dioxide. Um, not sure about this natural polluted water. I don't know where it's producing that. There isn't any out. But there we go. So I'm going to let that run for a little while. We'll see if this level comes down. See if it comes down below the the bed line. Uh, hopefully that will. And hopefully this will start producing oxygen. Yeah, because somebody's beaten up my algae, algae deoxidizer anyway, so I need to need to prioritize that. We'll make all this a seven. And yeah. End up gas management is going to be so much more important now we have more gases. Okay, the chlorine, as far as I know, we don't use the chlorine for anything, but we are still struggling. Um, yeah. At least we've got a way of getting rid of natural gas, though. I mean, the, well, talk about like the morbs could do it. I don't know if the morbs produce, you know, the morbs will uh, process some of this or not, but. We shall see. Let that run a bit. Unfortunately, I've got this little bit of. Well, it's just polluted water, polluted water. So, yeah, the people are being sick all over the place. So, we could run. Start running some mesh tiles around. And uh, food's becoming a bit of a problem as well here now. So. Okay, mesh tiles through there, and there. And we're going to deconstruct buildings through there. And I'm going to start taking out some of this here. That'll be the next thing, is that four kilograms of natural gas there and there. Actually no, we're gonna we're gonna lock that. And I'm going to cancel that. We're, we're not gonna touch this biome until I can figure out what to do with some of this natural gas. We can pump it out, move it into here. Uh, but we'll 
need to get rid of some of this in here first before I start flooding it with more. OK, thanks a lot for joining me. That'll be it for this episode. <laughs> we'll uh, catch you all in the next one. OK, and we're back, and things aren't going very well. Uh, I've just had two, one starve to death, one suffocate, and I just can't get rid of this natural gas. This, uh, put a pump down here. Uh, the, the, the amount of carbon dioxide it's put out, I've started pumping it down here instead of up here, which means this pump is no longer, I mean, this thing's still going, and this is still pumping enough to it, but this level is not coming down. So I put a pump up here, and I've added it, and it's now pumping down there, so I can get deconstruct that one. But the other problem I've got is that I can't get... This, this fresh water doesn't want to flow down to here. So I'm going to deconstruct that section there. That's another one died. Uh, oh, there's another one going to go as well. Um, it just not enough food. Where I thought bristle briars were, bristle blossoms were going to self plant, they haven't. Um, these things don't grow fast enough for me to to do this. It, nobody wants to come and repair this. Uh, let's, let's choose another duplicate. Let's go for. Um, Let's go for that one there. And I want to make some purely on repair. Oh, come on. Right. This put. Come on. No, not this put. I just want. Right. Hassan. You are purely going to be for repair. Perhaps you can deliver as well. So, let's just drop something down the stairs. And there's another one died. I'm down to four. But unless I can get rid of this natural gas, let's get another duplicate in there quick. See if I can stop this from minus two turns. Dig a exploitation. Loud sleeper. Don't want that. Don't want that. Gastrophobia. God, you are. There's another one gone as well, so I'm still at four. And I just can't get this. Right, so... Okay, so that, yeah, taking that out means that at least... I'm now feeding the scrubber. Actually, there should be enough food there, except they're all, they all want to eat the same food that I'm producing, so... Oh, I've got a feeling this, uh, this map here is going to come to an end, and I'm going to have to start again, having learnt what I've learnt. Nothing seems to have, from the electrics point of view, it's not suffering. Just about getting a little bit of uh, hydrogen up here. But I don't know how I'm going to be able to pull this back. But we shall see what happens and bring you back. And we're back and um, we're sort of suffering. I, it's just, I mean, I'm down to two, du two duplicates here. Uh, it's not, I haven't got a problem with power. Uh, food is down to next to nothing. This is why they're, they're dying. They are starving. But, um... Need to... Need to... Make some of this. But, I don't know... Just isn't enough of them to do anything. What are you doing here? Move. Go on. Get stuck. Give them too many options, they just get stuck and then run around not doing anything. Where are you going while oh, you're feeding that? Okay. I 
actually you shouldn't need that because you've got the scrubber here. So let's deconstruct to that. Never, never got the uh, rejuvenator built. I mean, I love this idea. If I could do this, I could just power this straight off of that. Just worry about. But it's, it's where it's flooded the rest of the base. Really should have thought. Okay, we'll build a. It's my biggest mistake. I should have built a, a um, what you call it trap in here, a liquid trap that would, would allow the dupes to get in and out of this area to build this without flooding the rest of the base. But once the rest of the base is flooded, I'm just really struggling to get get rid of this. I might struggle through. But it's certainly looking a bit shaky. And we're back. And as you can see, uh, we have no more duplicates. They are all dead. They have all pretty much starved to death. It's one that's suffocated, but yeah. So it's this food problem. The next time we start again, as well as this natural gas problem, which I just cannot. Well, it is coming down slightly, but this could be because there's more. We are getting a little bit of oxygen up here now. That's interesting. Did yes, I think it did, didn't it? The polluted oxygen sat on top of the breathable oxygen. But um, yeah, that this is the biggest problem, and we need to sort out food. Food is the other big problem. Uh, unless, well, we can have a look at. Mealwood seeds. I only have 36 mealwood seeds left, and yeah, I, th I think when we start, we're going to have to take only dupes that have got the minus three that can drink this, the the micro musher stuff. Um, but uh, there we go. Thank you very much for joining me. I'm going to have to uh, call it quit on this map for the minute. I mean, I could hang around and wait for one or two dupes to come in, but again, but I think it, they don't, they, they're just not, until I can sort a few problems out, do things differently next time. So till then, thanks for joining me. As I said, catch you on the next one. Mm -hmm.